Hey guys, it's Jonathan with Force of Awesome TCGs. Today I'm going to be giving you my top 5 list for Eternal Masters, or at least my favorite cards that has been uh, released as of this point. I, I'm, I th actually think this has been fully released. Anyways, um, Ancestral Mask is a great card. Uh, it is uh, very expensive on MTGO right at this moment, and it is a great pick for Eternal Masters to reprint. And then we have Curd Ape. This guy is absolutely amazing. Popper is going to have another amazing card in this set. Uh, Popper in general has gotten quite a few cards that it has needed reprinting very badly, and that is one. Armadillo Cloak is another one. It's not too expensive, but I really like this art. I like this art a little bit more than the other versions of the art. Um, it is amazing. It's going to bring down the price, and Poggles is such a fun deck for Popper. And now we have Hydroblast. Hydroblast is a $10 card right at this moment, or it was $10 uh, soon after filming this, before filming this, I should say. It is an excellent card. It's great in sideboards, and it's going to bring down the price of Popper quite a bit. And then we have Pyroblast. This is another Popper card that is just, it's too expensive. And it is not this card in particular, uh, Hydroblast is the one I'm talking about, but it is the reason why I didn't build Delver, because that card was too expensive, and with this card, with Hydro er, Pyroblast reprint, this is going to bring down that price, and it's going to bring Popper even bigger than it has ever been, because people have been complaining that the prices for Popper has been too expensive. Anyways, guys... I just wanted to give you my top five list, and it's all to do with Popper, just because Popper is like my favorite format right at this moment. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching, and have a great day. Thanks. Bye.